welcome back to spiderworking.com's video blog. You may have noticed last night Facebook pages went through a bit of a re revamp. If you haven't upgraded your page now, we're going to show you the way around and some of the great benefits and features that the new page offers, some of which we've all been looking for for a while. So log into your Facebook account and upgrade that page. The first thing I want to show you is how you can use your business page as your page on Facebook. So go to account and click use Facebook as a page and choose which page you want to be. Now from this point onwards anything you do on Facebook you're posting and in my case as spiderworking.com. So if I click on home you'll see that the updates I'm getting are from pages. Yep. So I'm signed in as a business. On the right hand side under notifications there's notifications of all the updates or anytime someone's commented or posted on my wall. And then here under friends you can see how many likes I've got and you get a notification every time you get a new one. Now if I type the page name in the top box here, so I'm going to go to Social Media Ireland. If I go to that page and if I like that page, I can now comment as spiderworking.com on any of the posts on that page. So I'm just going to write something on the wall. And click share and now you'll see your, my post comes up as from spiderworking.com and this is a great new feature and one I know people have been looking for for a while. Now you might be wondering where your tabs have gone that used to be at the top of the page here where the photos are. They're down here on the left hand side now you'll see there's photos, videos and if you had any customized tabs they're there. To edit a page now you click on edit page on the top right hand side of the page and there's a couple of new features here. So if you go to Featured on the left, click on that. Now you can choose um, to add featured likes. So out of all the pages that you like, which are your favorite pages from the first, you can choose specific ones that you want to feature. And you can also add featured page owners. If you want people to know that you admin the page, this is the place to go. Under your settings, you can change a few things here. So you can click on always comment and post on a page as spiderworking.com um, to allow you to post on your own page under your own name, which I'll show you now. Click on view page. And if we scroll down until I can find something relevant to comment on. And you'll see when I click on comment, Rather than a picture of spiderworking.com, there's a picture of me. Now, one more thing I want to show you is you've got an admin view to your page rather than the default view that everyone else sees. If you click that, you see posts in chronological order, making it easier to see what's been happening most recently on your page. If you're still confused by the new page layout, leave us a comment below this video or tweet us at spiderworking.com or come onto our Facebook page and ask the question. URL here. See you next week. Bye.